good afternoon children in the previous class we were discussing about coordinate geometry under coordinate uh, geometry uh, we are discussing about uh, how to find the distance between the two points right so we know that the distance formula is x to uh, d equals to square root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square and uh, distance of a point from the origin uh, that is d is equals to square root of x square plus y square and also we are discussing about uh, section formula so section formula can be written as uh, p of x comma y is equals to square mx2 plus nx1 divides by m plus n into my2 plus ny1 divides by m plus n and also we are discussing about midpoint formula right so midpoint formula is p of x comma y is equals to x1 plus x2 by 2 and y1 plus y2 by 2 and uh, uh, in this session i am going to take you on the same topic how to find uh, the area of triangle the area of triangle uh, so usually we know that uh, area of triangle in geometry uh, in geometry the area of triangle is half into base into height half into base into height but in uh, coordinate geometry there is uh, another formula to find the uh, area of uh, triangle that is uh, square a is equals to half into x1 into y2 minus y3 plus x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 so right so area of triangle half into uh, x1 into y2 minus y3 plus x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 right so here we have one uh, uh, we have a sum uh, so that is find the value of k if the points uh, a b c that is uh, a is 2 3 b is 4 k and c is 6 minus 3 are collinear are collinear so we know that collinear collinear is nothing but uh, all the points uh, should be lying on the same line all the points uh, should be lying on the same line right so here find the value of k we need to find the value of k if the points where a is uh, 2 3 that is x1 y1 x1 y1 is 2 3 and uh, b is 4k that is x2 y2 so x2 y2 is 4k and uh, the point c is 6 3 so that is uh, x3 and y3 where x3 is 6 uh, and y3 is minus 3 are collinear since the given points are collinear the area of triangle formed by them must be 0 must be 0 since the given points are collinear so we know that the, the uh, all the points all the points uh, should be lying on the same line uh, so that is uh, uh, called as collinear since the given points since the given points are collinear so therefore the area of triangle formed by them must be as uh, zero that is a is equals to zero area of triangle must be equals to zero so first of all we need to find the uh, area of triangle is equals to uh, we know that uh, area of triangle is equals to 1 by 2 half into this is x uh, ascending order x1 into y2 minus y3 plus x2 into y3 minus y1 plus x3 into y1 minus y2 so the given points are uh, where a is where a is so this is a uh, x1 y1 and this is x2 y2 and c is x3 y3 respectively right so uh yeah area of triangle half into this is uh, so it can be written as 1 by 2 into here x1 what is the value of x1 so yes x1 is 2 and y1 is 3 so when we substitute x1 has 2 so this is instead of x1 we take uh, x2 then y2 is uh, k minus y3 is minus minus 3 y3 is minus 3 plus x2 x2 is 4 into x2 is 4 into y3 this is minus 3 minus y1 is plus 3 see x2 is minus x2 is plus 4 into y3 is minus 3 this is formula minus then y1 is plus minus 3 
okay then uh, see this is plus into so here x3 is 6 into this is 6 6 into again y1 is 3 this is formula minus and then y2 is k y2 is k which is equals to 0 so area should be equals to 0 this implies that uh, yes this implies that uh, so we get to 1 by 2 into this is uh, 2 into see k into minus into minus plus 3 minus into minus plus 3 plus 4 into this is minus 3 minus 3 when we had these two we get uh, minus 6 uh, minus 6 so plus into plus 6 into 3 minus k which is equals to 0 so now 1 by 2 into this is 2 into k 2k plus into plus plus 2 3 is 6 plus into minus minus 4 6 24 plus into plus plus 6 3 is 18 plus into minus minus 6 into k 6k equals 0 6k equals 0 so now we get 1 by 2 into this is mm, when we had these two when we subtract plus 2 from uh, uh, minus 6k we get uh, this is uh, minus 4k and uh, when we had these two plus 24 uh, and minus 24 we get uh, see 18 plus 6 uh, it is plus 24 and remaining minus 24 minus 24 therefore see here plus 24 minus 24 gets cancelled plus 24 minus 24 gets cancelled then remaining here we have 1 by 2 2 into this is minus 4k equals 0 when we multi when we divide uh, say this is 2 ones are 2 yes 2 ones are 2 2 twos are 4 hence we get minus 2k equals 0 therefore k is equals to 0 by minus 2 hence we get uh, k is equals to we know that 0 by anything is 0 therefore the value of k is therefore the value of k is 0 let us verify our answer yes